Hi, welcome to Excel Tech. Today we have Functions Episode 7 and we're going to cover the ACOTH function. Excel's description of this is it returns the inverse hyperbolic cotangent of a number. So basically what that means is we're going to use the inverse cotangent to find the intersecting coordinates on a cotangent graph. To produce this hyperbolic cotangent graph, you will use the formula cot x equals e to the x plus e to the negative x over e to the x plus e to the negative x. We're going to enter the inverse hyperbolic cotangent values which will search the x coordinates and return the y coordinates where the line intersects. So let's start with the first example. Let's find the a cot of 2. And to do that, we'll work our way along the x coordinates until we find where the line intersects the number 2. Then we'll work our way up to see that 0 0.549 is the returned value on the y coordinate. Now let's try with the value of 4. We can work our way along to find where the line intersects the number 4 in the x coordinates, and you'll see that it returns a value of 0 0.255 on the y coordinates. This isn't just limited to the numbers being produced in this graph. If you look, Excel has returned the inverse of 1000, producing the result of 0 0.001. The ACOTH function can also work with negative numbers. You'll see it produces a negative 0 0.549 result from the negative 2. You'll also notice that a hyperbolic cotangent graph never intersects the x coordinates between minus 1 and 1, and if we tried any of these values it would produce a number of error, like in this example of 0 0.5. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to leave any questions or comments in the section below, and thanks for watching.